Assalamu alaikum and welcome to my channel Learn with Fun by Zarar sir. Today we will be discussing about behavior of resistor in an AC circuit. So let's begin with this like I assume that by voltage or instantaneous voltage is V is equal to Vm sin omega t. Okay and I have a resistance R over here and the current flowing through this is instantaneous current is I. So I can start with basic ohms law of V is equal to IR. Therefore, I is equal to V by R. Okay, this is the basic thing. Now I can write I is equal to Vm sine omega t upon R since my V is equal to Vm sine omega t. Now you can see I can write Vm by R because this is only the thing that will impact the current. So I will be I m sin omega t. So I get this value as I or instantaneous current. My V was V m sin omega t. So as you can see both resistance and current sorry both voltage and current are in phase. There is no difference in the phase of voltage and current in terms of resistance. So my waveform will be if I assume this x axis and y axis. Now my voltage for instantaneous sorry instantaneous voltage will be something like this. So this waveform which I have shown over here is Vm sin omega t. Okay this waveform is Vm sin omega t and now this volt this uh, waveform over here this waveform is I m sin omega t and as you can see both are in phase okay both are in phase uh, though the amplitude is less because we are dividing it through resistance because at least we will have 1 ohm or 100 ohm or 1 kilo ohm resistance so it will be less hence uh, you can understand that there is no phase difference between voltage and current during the behavior of resistance but as we move towards inductor and capacitor you will find out there is a difference of phase in inductor and capacitor okay hope you have understand the fundamental related to behavior of resistor in ac circuit in the next lecture we'll be understanding behavior of inductor in ac circuit and in the next lecture capacitor so once we have done with the fundamental of uh, resistor capacitor inductor we'll be moving towards different concept of series and parallel Hope you have enjoyed this video. Thanks a lot. Do like and subscribe my channel. Okay. Thank you.